That one comes inside the line. Here's Jones on the sharp angle. Rebound scores! Intercepted here. Delaney takes a look. There's a shot. He scores! <laughs> T.J. Delaney with the intercept. And it's 1-0 Cochran. Through the goal crease. Delaney the other way. Feeds it up. Bennett back over. Castle with a shot. It's in there. He scores! Finds Delaney. Delaney, he's got Stoffer with him. Delaney takes a look. Stoffer, great move. He scores. Five to go here in overtime. D'Agostino flips that one towards the goal. Unruh leaves it there. Delaney. Delay is in behind his own goal. Leaves it for Lovey. Lovey with a great move. Lovey coming up the ice. Voodoo's on a line change. Lovey cutting around. There's a shot. He scores! Connor Lovey finishes it off in double overtime. And the... Oh. Cochran with the puck, Delaney behind the net, passes it over to Hernandez. The cross comes into the line, shoots, great save by Barrett. Seo with the puck, shoves it over to Kalisti. Oh, bad bounce off the end board, and, and there it is, Cochran scores. And game is over. What an unfortunate bad bounce. But they'll take it. And that's the final 5-4 in the second overtime. A minute 25 to go here in this second period. And about a two-second difference between the penalty clock and the game clock. Here's Delaney. Shoots! That one goes up high. Flanders keeps it in. Herbster chases after it in the corner on the near side. Flanders, rather Herbster, looking to the point, gets it to Lovey, back to Herbster. Herbster, Lovey, takes it, back to Herbster, feathers it in, there's a chance, he scores! Boy lights the lamp on the power play. TJ Delaney makes it 5 nothing. Keeping it in. Taken here by Booth. Up ahead for Dolman. Dolman takes a look. Dolman over. There's a shot. He scores. TJ Delaney stays red hot. He's going to tip that one in to make it a 3 nothing Cochran lead. Dolman gets an errant puck and scores. Puck comes to Lovey at the point. Lovey comes up and takes a shot. 
Another shot saved by Roca. Rebound. Goes in. Let her go. Draw one cleanly by the cover. Here's a chance. Rebound and in by Booth. They'll go on the power play to the left of Roca. Face off one by Cochran. Comes to the point. Puck shot comes to Lovey. Lovey. They storm the crease like bumblebees. They travel like a burning flame. We see them slide, the puck's inside, it's a 1-1 hockey game. He push, gets up the center ice, dumps that one in, cast in there. He's being horribly pursued, it's Cochran with the puck, center pass, oh! Just missed wide, what a chance there, probably the best scoring opportunity. Now Bennett chooses through a crowd, again deflected, Masternak got a toe, and have another chance, there it is! Nobody home, no help at all for Masternak. Had to make a series of saves. Puck bounces right out front. And Johnny on the spot. Delaney coming up from behind the net. Taps it into a yawning cage. And the Delaney in on the forecheck for the crunch. Zong gets taken out. Bradburn comes back to support low. Picks it up. Little pass off the boards to himself, but he couldn't get it. And the crunch come right back and put some pressure again here on the Rock defense. And, of course, that's usually the rock strength because these long shifts that, you know, real heavy shifts as you want to call them, sir. But Cochran kind of taking it to him in that sense here early in well, the first six minutes of the first period. Well, Cochran definitely showed up without the bus legs. And uh, the rock will almost look like they're skating in sand. They're just having a real tough time getting anything going. And Whalen. Go ahead. Whalen with a quick shot there. Just went wide. That's recovered on the half board. Pretty well till the end. Connor Levy moves it to Hernandez. Hernandez moves it down low to uh, Herbster. Now it's back to Herbster. Herbster goes low to Delaney. Cross ice. Nice play. Scores! Masternak made the first save with the rebound squirted out. Carrying it up. He has that knocked over him before he can get to center ice. Delaney crosses center. Uses his long reach to get around one guy. Now two. Here's a chance for Delaney. Five ball scores. Forehand, backhand, open up. Two minutes. Puts it home. Couple of nice moves there by T.J. Delaney. He had the hometown crunch. The only lead less than ten minutes into the game. That was uh, Gallant, I believe. No, nope, that was both Dodge. Eighteen. Delaney with it. Delaney center and ready. Scores again. Five hole. Reached over. That's White Put it through the wicket of Lume. Didn't look like he had much room. But when you got to reach that long, funny things happen. He went a uh, little bit of a forehand backhand or put it or backhand back to the forehand. Slid it through the pads of Dube. And the Crunch have regained their lead. Shots on goal. Not Whalen. Whalen. Delaney now. Nice move to get around one guy. Cuts to the front of the net. Two scores. Wow, what a call. DJ Delaney. Look out. Eight to six. So, first shot of the period goes to the crunch. And one by the crunch. Lovey again goes back into the same spot. Takes a shot through the crunch. Tipped in by DJ. Walks it to the middle of the ice, fires a shot, Delaney had the brain of a stick there, and uh, tips one by the goaltender, Kane McCoon, who really didn't have much of a chance on that one at all. And on the 31st... When Nelagoose thought he was going to zag, and the Crunch got a three-on-one here, quick shot there, and they call out the Pelican next drive. Quick shot there 
Rebound comes out. Kostolanski makes no mistake. Buries it in the empty net. And we got a 1-1 hockey game here in Cochran. Trying to tie it up along the boards to kill off some time. Hernandez trying to come in. Crafty loses his stick and loses the battle along the boards. Herbster holding it. Now he gets the pass back. Herbster back to the blue line. Heavy shot by Hernandez. He scores. Thomas Hernandez on the power play has tied the game at one. This is the block. It's back up to Levy. He's going to walk in. He shoots again through the corner. He scores! He Seven minutes in. That's the hope. That's the game that uh, Coach Leonard was hoping they would do. Get a little more traffic in front of the Chance. And uh, in just under seven minutes, they've equaled the amount of goals they scored in the first two games of the Cup. Off that penalty, we've got 3.54 remaining in the period. Delaney, down low. Tries to go high. Crassie gets the stick in front of that one. Oh, nice play there by Delaney to lift the stick and keep the puck in. Grassy spins and fires, but not out. Glove down by Lovey. Lovey moves it to Herbster. Back to Lovey. Back to Herbster. Herbster walks into the middle. Takes a shot. Go! Oh! Delaney was in front of the net. Causing some traffic in front of LaChelle. And that's what the crunch need to do. They need to keep bodies in front of LaChelle. Don't let them see it. It's so hard to stop when you don't see it back down to Herbster. Herbster goes down to Delaney. Delaney in the center of pass. Herbster had a chance right in front of the net, fired it over the glass. Lovey picks it up, walks it back out to the top, gives it to Hernandez. It came back to Lovey. Hit Dolman takes shot. Oh, I thought that was a stake. I thought And misses the mark. Herbster chases down into the corner, gains possession of the puck, walks his way out, goes back down to Delaney. Delaney in the front, scores! TJ Delaney! Got it right in the front of the net, right around Brito, and it's a goal. Two goal. Unreal. Whalen. Down there doing battle with Donovan. Donovan wins his battle. Kept in by Bennett. Bennett shoots on goal. Rebound. There it is. Yeah. They completed it. Four straight games. And they are going to Dryden for the Hewitt. It's over, folks. After almost four and a half periods of play, it's happened. Austin Whelan, third year veteran, bangs it in in front of the net, and they've done it. They're going on. Connor Lovey will live to play another day. His junior career continues on for at least three more days. Congratulations to this organization, Ryan Leonard, Shane Battler, what a game he played, carried his team on his back, brought them here to the top, they pulled it off, couldn't be happier for Coach Ryan Leonard, owner, operator, the GM, he worked so hard to get these players in. He brings them in from all over Canada. And they put it together and they pulled it off. What an experience this is going to be for them to go to the Dudley Hill Cup. And now they're giving it to the fans. They want to hear it. Commissioner Robert Mazuka walking out with the Copeland Cup McNamara Trophy, which will be presented.